It's small, but busy. And for users of the Wasilla Airport, the cost to keep an aircraft there might be going up. We haven't raised our fees in 20 years, so we need to get the fees up to where they should be. Earlier this month, the Wasilla Public Works Department informed registered users of price changes on the horizon. That includes costs for hangar space lease, which could go up by four cents per square foot, plus higher charges for tie downs with or without electricity, up to a $25 monthly increase, and transient parking, which could in turn increase the airport's fiscal revenue by about $71,000. That's something that the chair of the airport advisory committee says is necessary if the city wants the airport to get out of the red and finally see much needed expansions. If we can expand it to over 6,000 feet, we can start doing larger aircraft, go up to the slope and get all that business, cargo, you name it with maintenance teams coming out here as well. So we just want to build the airport and make it really financial feasible and a huge asset to Wasilla. But users of the airport say the burden should fall on the city and that demand for more space is so high, developers might be willing to eat the cost of building new infrastructure. But if you kept it the same or increased it a smaller amount, you could build more, hang you could allow people to put their own money in, build their own hangars, and the city get that money in what appears to be already developed land. With a wait list of people wanting a spot at this airport, the decision to increase costs will now go before the Wasilla City Council in the coming weeks. Carly Schreck, Alaska's News Source.